I wonder how many extremes on theme realization this song will play to, because I consider the contemporary lens of it in view of other Bleed Out tracks, for example, Wireless and The War Focus, like with that number, The Plight of Veterans, as I simplified it, at least in my own interpretation. And maybe there was, again, a broad offering there. Oh, I know there were, but... I consider pieces like that a number entitled We Go to War, and I automatically sense a connection deliberately. Or I can look at the philosophy of this album as I have best articulated it in my own view of experience in humoring seven numbers of it thus far out of an 11-track body. And I immediately pick up on the cue of, as I said many times, personalized empowerment through life's tribulations, whatever they might look like. And there's been a good sampling of uh, subjects that have been cataloged in specific focus or allowance of broad application that's been demonstrated readily by every number on this album that has spoken to, again, that particular theme of empowerment. That's been grounded in each work to a degree, again, deliberately stated by not only the group, but just in my own view, I see that deliberacy of, again, a personalized journey, very well told by Within Temptation. I don't expect anything less. Quite a powerful group, again, in the European metal sphere of Dutch origin and symphonic metal standing, favorite of mine, and an early entry into the world of European metal, of which I've taken a significant deep dive since. And now that we are at the We Go to War treatment, you can see, with Intentation specifically, we've taken a long ride with in terms of mutual exposure. And I think music, as I've said many times, is best enjoyed in a collaborative sense, irrespective to our approach. And if you are a longtime fan or a fresh initiate listener, I welcome you. We've, you know, consider our journey so far, if you're exposed to my work, from early initiation of Within Temptation in terms of mutual journeys, I would bleed out. All the pieces now that we get to humor are going to be a fresh standing, so we return from that detour path of reintroduction to those first impression witnesses of where we began with Within Temptation. All of these pieces yet I'd not recognized for myself, and I've been waiting it out for months now. I'd not meant to delay this long, but that's the way life goes, especially in the holiday season. Anywho, I'm now in December. It's taken me that long. I'm not proud of it. We get to finally enjoy Bleed Out in full together. For a full album run through, as I promised you, now with those new works I've not yet welcomed. And we're going to see together what the direction is of We Go to War. If it is deliberately perhaps a tie in association to directly with the war focus wireless, or if it is more evidently as expressed through the song as well, I'm sure that'll amplify the message, even though the lyrics, I, I can see them speaking to both extremes, but the song I think will do a lot of the heavy lifting as well. It's a great tool in consideration of with indentation design work. The instrumentals really amplify that pathos direction. At least I've recognized that in the past couple of numbers, I consider the message sentimentality of what's so readily offered in metal and what I have admired over many years and what drew me in at first immediately. Outside, of course, favoritism with the sound and a- a- aggressive root especially, though again, symphonic metal offers quite a versatility and I'm open myself to really any type of sound quality, even some outlier groups and artists I recognize here that don't necessarily operate by the metal terminology or wildly adrift from that. Open door policy here, really for anything. And with indentation, similar credits to any other artist. Future developments, I am eagerly ready and waiting for, whatever that looks like, like I was for Bleed Out. And now we have those last four works that came out on part of the full album debut, and we finally get to enjoy it together. For myself, I don't have to hold out any longer. <laughs> Let's explore We Go to War on Fresh Initiation. And if this is, in fact, the initiation journey for you, I would recommend humoring those numbers uh, that we've previously entertained as you go through the album for yourself. They are worth your time. Though, this is the first track on the record, so you might want to start here and then look at those pieces, whether in your own uh, isolated time or alongside me. You know, again, music is best enjoyed in company, but it is a subjective journey first and foremost, so leave a determination up to you. But we go to war. Let's enjoy this in company together for a first time listen and see what extremists floats around in terms of an instrumental uh, delivery, but on lyrics too. Let's see how the message takes shape even beyond what I've just lightly skimmed through. Let's see it in realization and effect. Oh, hang on, that's the wrong tab, okay. Soft. Again, a bit of an ancient cue. Fantasy drift ties well into where we're going with Bleed Out. Really like that rubber voice, good syncopation on the riff pacing. Familiar symphonic voices, background choir with a symphony mixing, I love it. Oh, the cue choice is fantastic. Pretty invigorating rhythm too. Again, even on that subtle appearance, I love it. 
naturally grounded. I love the vibration. The pitch is just so high and it was and then natural. All those inclines. My thoughts get ahead of me in terms of the emotional sentiment. It just really connects, doesn't it? A balanced performance from her. Good line there. The oppositional side of the lyrics to it, a contrast, the, the present disposition with the willingness and desire for something else, good contrast. Fantastic reaches. That's fantastic. Organized very well by where we go from the number. Beautiful lead in. Versatile symphonic metal. With a heavy metal backing, I really admire the pair. Vocals linger in the background too. It's just it, perfect touch. Beautiful recap to the origin of the song. Fantastic choice. I do like a bookend structure. Fully concrete refrain. Every element gets a refrain. It's like church bells. Or maybe like a Maybe like a wartime signal. You know, speaking of atmosphere, that tune is beautiful resonance. It could play again, like I said, to a variety of extremes of interpretation. That's the beautiful thing about certain tunes within music that it is open to such broad application. You know, I've spoken about that atmosphere. You know, I like specialized numbers, and again, there's a declared intent. And I've said that there is a deliberate theming that comes through on this album. And this I do see in comparison to, let's say, our conclusion of Entertain You. It does come across like an initiation journey, like the start of the conflict. As I've said, personalized journey of empowerment through review and uh, um, uh, working through present life tribulations or past ones as well, you know, whatever you want to look at. And before coming to you, you can make an argument there. This could be seen as the initiation to that conflict. When we hear the call, we go to war and leave it all now to bring it back again. Yeah. Will defy till the end. It is like a personalized revolution song. Though it could as well have ties, I think. Again, there's a revolutionary spirit to it. So, interpretation, specifically with standing, again, I'll, I'll leave it whatever the personalized one would be for your determination. If you wish to specify down below, of course, feel free. 
because that's the beauty about music. Again, we have so many vantage points to consider. What we can all agree on, I'm sure, dominant symphonic metal entrance. I love it as an introductory song. It has a beautiful swing. The rhythm is incredibly engaging, beautifully developed, intermixed with the background touches on the choir. A usual trait you find in appearance in symphonic metal, in fact, and a favorite of mine. It's part of the reason, again, anything that cues up an orchestral simulation, I'm automatically in line with. I'm right in its mind. And... <sighs> The way we initiate with the song The Bells, too, great touch, different, specialized. I have said now, if each piece on this record, there's a specialized voice to some degree, this is potently symphonic. It's a bit of a slower rhythm, slightly repressed again on pacing, but still deliberate emphasis on the riffs, especially in that bridge instrumental. That's a great break. I love the harsher route to it. Symphonic on first appearance is heavy metal support. It's, but again, each is done sort of in an equal... Uh, uh, space. And even in the tonal direction, there are shifts. Look at the first verse, for example. The vocals, the tune, drawn in a bit. The vocals are quite softer, especially, well, not just with the first verse, but the uh, pre-chorus as well. And once the chorus launches back in, the heavy riff support reinvigorates along with the higher pitched vocals, in the, well, higher pitch and more forceful. But still, they're kind of at that um, familiarized uh, melodic expectancy with Sharon's delivery, which is, just, is always so great. But the picture on this number on tune construction is fantastic. I love it. It's a wide atmospheric listen, a beautiful one, invigorating, perfect as always, from Within Temptation. I love humoring their work. I hope you enjoyed that one as well. I know I'm late to the ball on this, but I did promise you a full album run through no long, or no matter how long it takes me. <laughs> and I do keep my word, even with my tardiness. <laughs> I wish it weren't the case. Because I, again, I've held out for months now. I'm grateful I have to experience that with you in a first witness. How great. What are your thoughts on that particular piece down below? And again, from whatever angle you approach, I'd love to hear it longtime fan or initiate listener, and what do you see in terms of a narrative here? And if there is, in fact, a synonymy, I could see branches, again, connecting to wireless and ever songs of similar theming, but again, of a revolutionary spirit, I feel this is perfectly in line with the album's journey as a whole of what, again, we've experienced in now eight numbers. Going on nine, as of the next entry, that being worth dying for, a follow-up to wireless, in fact. Hmm, I could already predict maybe directions on that. We'll see what the lyrics, and we'll let the song speak for itself, but on, on reintroducing ourselves again in order of fresh impression witnesses to bleed out with We Go to War, what a fantastic first encounter. Loved it. Love that piece. Immediate re-listen. I'm looking forward to hearing more again alongside all of you. Thank you so much for watching this video. Before you bounce, feel free to drop a like and comment, subscribe to this channel with a ding on the bell, and share this video with your friends. And consider checking out the description here. There you'll find links to my other channels, as well as addresses to my other social media accounts and ways you can help support my work if you feel so inclined. May God bless you, and looking forward to when our paths cross again.